Hey guys, this is Jong Ching here, and today I'm going to show you how to stitch individual image of a scenery into a Parama image using the new image stitching feature of the Parama Persona in the new Affinity Folder 1.4. And most smartphone camera apps like the iPhone nowadays have the Parama function built in, so you can straight away take the Parama image from the camera apps itself. But in some case, or you just want to use a uh, software to uh, stitch individual image into a parallel mind mesh, then this method work best for you. So let's get into it. First, you need to go far and then new parama and then add your image here and select your image and then click open and then click stitch parama. And then an affinity photo will start rendering the preview of the final image. And if you like what you see, just go ahead click OK. And then affinity photo will start rendering the final image. And if you see the swing line here, no worry, it will disappear after the rendering process. OK. And as you can see, there's a lot of missing area here. And to repair, repair the missing area, you can use the chop tool to chop the image or you can use this tool to, to make the affinity photo automatically fill out the MP area. And all you have to do is click this button and then click apply. And affinity photo will start rendering the image again to repair the missing area. And please take note that not every time this repair will work very well. And especially if you have a large missing area like mine and you will get the, some bad result and as you can see there's some error here and here also and this image stitching feature is not always great and as you can see the roof of the canding there's some imbalance here okay but that's how you uh, stitch individual image into a parama. So that's all for this video. I hope you enjoy my video and I hope you learn something from this video. And if you like it, make sure to give a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. So that's all guys. Let's see you again in the next video. Bye bye.